Persons, Part 1 Contents 1. Overview 2. The Persons Panel 3. Creating Company Hierarchy 4. Importing Company Hierarchy Overview Persons Management is done in the Persons Panel Persons are shown in a tree structure with companies, divisions, centers, departments and individual persons. The company hierarchy can be created manually, or imported from a CSV file. Persons can be users with physical access to the security installation or operators who operate the TCOM C4 system or both. There should only be one record per person. Persons Panel Persons Management is done in the Persons Panel. Persons are shown in a tree structure in the record list. The filter menu shows options for filtering the person's tree. For example, show persons who are archived or who are logged in as TCOM C4 operators. Create the company hierarchy by adding companies, departments, persons, etc. Right click on the root node and select Add Company to add a company. A company name must be entered for it to be saved to the TCOM C4 database. Other information may be entered about the company, such as its address, etc. Divisions Centers and departments may also be added under a company to create the company structure. The red shield icon with the white exclamation point indicates a data error, and the red box indicates its location. To fix the problem, enter valid data in the field. To add a person, right click a node in the tree and select Add Person. Three types of persons may be added, manager, person, or external employee. Enter a surname for the person for them to be saved to the TCOM C4 database. Information about the person, such as their position, etc. may also be entered. Tick the long access checkbox to enable long access for the user. Add more departments, persons, etc. as necessary. Importing company hierarchy. A company hierarchy can be imported from a CSV file. The first line of the CSV file must have field names that can be mapped to fields in TCOM C4. The operator maps the fields when importing. The CSV file must have a primary key field with a unique number for each record that can be mapped to the ID field in TCOM C4. The CSV file must have a field that can be mapped to the category field in TCOM C4, defining whether the record is for a company, division, person, etc. A hierarchy can be defined in the CSV file by using a parent reference field, for example a person in a department would have the department's unique ID number in its parent reference field. Roles and access levels can be imported if they are already defined in TCOM C4. Cards and pins can also be imported. Note, see the TCOM C4 operators manual for more detailed information on importing CSV files. To import from CSV, right-click on the desired node and select External Data, Import. Click the Browse button in the Select File dialog window. Locate the CSV file to import, 
Select it and click the open button. Click the next button to open the file. Ensure that each source field from the CSV file matches the correct TCOM C4 target field. Click the next button to continue. Review the changes and click the next button to import. Click the finish button. The company hierarchy has been imported.